before we start, I just want to give all credit to this guy on screen right now for making all of these videos. Hello everybody, and today I decided to make this video on this guy I've been seeing on YouTube Shorts making these videos about uh, generations and stuff. And since I'm a loser who gets offended easily, I'm going to psychoanalyze all of these videos and explain why they're either incorrect or I don't like them. Now I understand these are all jokes, but I'm dumb, so I do not like them. Anyways, the first video we're going to be looking at is this video about um, microgens. And um, there's a lot wrong with this video, so I am going to explain everything that's wrong with it for no real reason other than I'm bored. 13 year olds are Gen Z. Gen Alpha. Alpha start in 2012. 2010. Mm, the battle of the brainless. Sounds like you need a micro gen. To heat up my dino nuggies? That's microwave. Brainless. And what's a micro gen? Well, we are. As fake as the tooth fairy. The tooth fairy's fake. Brainless. We're the bridge between two generations. A bridge I'd love to burn. They're half-breed, half-wits that can't commit to a gen. So they pretend to be their own. We are generations. Just little ones. So you're... A millennial Gen Z mix. Gen X millennial mix. And I'm what you get when... You don't wear protection. So you guys are like two gens in one. The bogo we wish would go-go. I think it's cool. Well, you also still think Santa Claus is... Ah! Oh, hey, hey. Who are all these people? We're micro-gens. I'm Boomer X. Oh, I do love me a younger man. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a- The first big thing I notice is wrong with this video is the fact that the little Gen Alpha kid says that, um, Gen Alpha is 2010 and after, which is just mathematically incorrect. As you can see from this chart I stole from Google, Gen Z is 1997 to 2012, because each generation is 15 years. Now, if you do your math correctly, 1997 plus 15 would equal 2012, not 2010. Now, this chart is also kind of flawed because it says there's two boomers, which is also incorrect. And you may be thinking that, oh, well, why are some generations 26 years? Well, that is because before, generations were longer, but now they're shorter. Another thing that's incorrect about this video is the fact that they make Gen Alpha look like these idiots who are, well, of course, as the millennial guy says, brainless. But that's not true at all. Most Gen Alphas I know are actually pretty smart, but that's most likely just from where I live. Also, when the depiction of the millennial says that the microgens are as fake as a tooth fairy, Gen Alpha gets all confused and is like, oh, the tooth fairy's fake? Which wouldn't happen if a 14-year-old is part of Gen Alpha because no one over the age of 8 believes in the tooth fairy. Anyways, enough of that. Another trope I see in these videos is that they make the younger generations look stupider as if they don't know a bunch of things. Like in this next video I'm about to talk about, that has to do with phones. What's this? A Zach Morris phone. Looks like a brick. Clearly, you haven't seen the Nokia 3310. Who's Zach Morris? Well, him and Kelly Capel. It's just a portable phone. Aren't all phones portable? Not this one. That's a phone? And a straitjacket. It's a landline. Oh, I drew a landline in art class. You mean Horizon Line? Yeah, the phone company. There's been a lot of different types of phones. True. You know, when I was young, we invented the wheel. Took a woolly mammoth to work. You were young? To communicate, we use hieroglyphic carrier pigeon, two cups and a lot of string. F you, man. <laughs> Basically, phones have been around for a while, and they stop listening. What are you doing? Eh, it's like the good old days. God, I hate all of you. This video is incorrect because it assumes that all Gen Alphans don't know their history and just assume that phones were always portable, which is kind of dumb because Gen Alphas do know their history and aren't that stupid. Hey, have you seen this new thing called a Tamagotchi? That is not new. Well, new and improved. Just released. I'm gonna release your head from your body if you take one more thing from our generation and try to claim it as your own. Well, that new flip phone idea, that's us. No, it's not, Columbus. This is a flip phone. Whoa, is that the thing they use for Morse code? This is my nightmare. Also, we've got a new snack you should try. I swear to God, if you say Dunkaroos. Dunkaroos. Oh my God, stop stealing our things. And also, stop sampling our music! We're not old enough for that! We don't! Really? Tap in! My type! Big energy! All samples from Too Short, Petey Pablo, and Mariah f***ing Carey! Oh, so you mean old artists from like the 1900s. <sighs> 
Also, have you heard of the new clothing brand called Champion? Ah, ah, Jesus, oh my knee. This video is also really similar to the last one because it assumes that we don't know our history, which is incorrect. Us Gen Zers know that Tamagotchi is not new. We know that, and we're not dumb enough to think it's new. So stop pretending like we are. Bro, where's Gen X? Mm -hmm. What? Oh, oh, I didn't even notice you there. Per usual. Where have you been? Minded my f***ing business. Well, we gotta have work. Oh, do you actually know how to use them in real life? Oh? Y'all been too quiet. Y'all been too loud. Because we're trying to change the world. And we're just trying to survive it. <laughs> listen. No, you, you listen, you cabbage patch killjoy. <laughs> oh, yes. We were raised on hose water and neglect, TV dinners and dial-up. We're sarcastic cynics who didn't talk about trauma. We just stuffed it down and sucked it up. Well, maybe. You shouldn't come for the latchkey kids who grew up with grass stains, told time by the street light, and were built by f***ing around and find out. This is great. So if you're coming for us, Stranger Things, you better come correct, because we're just here to kick ass and chew bubble gum. What? And we're all, all out, out of bubble, bubble gum. gum. Mm. Literal chills. Shut up. <laughs> now leave me the hell alone. Why are you scared of him? Because the quiet ones are killers. You're the Lulu. And you owe me a popcorn. It's sad that there's so many Gen Xers like this pretending like they're better than all the other generations just because there was stuff they didn't have that we have now. Well, because we don't care that you drink out of the water hose or had to be back inside by like 11 p.m. Nobody cares, okay? Bro, stop using so many laughing emojis. Would you rather emoticons? Emoto what? Emodium? <laughs> We're fine. It's just this little What's an emoticon? Like colon dash close parentheses. What? Or semicolon if I'm feeling flirty. So you used to type out emojis? We used to just talk on the phone. Ew. That's disgusting. Bro, when something's funny, just send a skull emoji. Why? To be like, I'm dying. You sure you don't need emodium? Laughing. Honey, a bad case of the runs isn't funny. Mm, depends. Oh, do you need a pair? No. Listen, if I don't send the laugh, then how else am I supposed to send a serious message that also says, JK, just in case I have to take it back? Why would you have to take it back? Because I assume everyone hates me. We oh, do. Oh, we do. See? You realize you all have serious issues, right? Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm fine. God, I hate it here. Now, if you didn't know, I'm Gen Z. I was born in 2012, and um, I use emoticons a lot. And I know the history of why emoticons existed. So, um, I... I'm not sure if other people in Gen Z are like this, but we're not stupid where we don't know history. And I'm sick of videos like this acting like we are don't know our history and are just stupid. Because that's just not true. My birthday! What are you turning? Four? Teen! <laughs> you forget how old he is again? Yeah. When did iPad babies become screenagers? I'll be in high school soon. I just graduated high school. 20 years ago. In 1980? That was 40 years ago. <laughs> You do realize I'm like 27. You were born last century? Oh, easy. He's the geriatric. <laughs> easy, Giggles. You're older than me. I don't care. Oh, this AARP thing came in the mail for you. Oh, I'm gonna need more wine. So much more wine. So, what are we doing for my birthday? Probably taking him to a nursing home. <laughs> you. <laughs> this was the first video that was actually funny and made me laugh. Anyway, enough of that. Let's go back to being negative. Um, anyway... I forgot to put this earlier in the video, but like I was saying about generations, each generation is 15 years, and Gen Alpha is not 14 because of many reasons I stated earlier, so I don't want to have to repeat those again, so I'm just gonna not do that. Hey, when were you born? 1990. 19? <laughs> no, uh, hold on. Are you elderly? Yeah, he is. No. When he was born, there was no YouTube. <gasps> Stop it! What did you watch on your iPad? There were no iPads. What? Okay, listen. Uh, Are you gonna die soon? I'm not old! Oh, the 1900s isn't so funny anymore, is it, Zoomy Zoom? I was born in 99! Which was last century. Bingo! <laughs> <laughs> Stop. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> What's his problem? <laughs> He realized he was born in 1990. Uh, millennial. He's not a millennial. <clears throat> Here's another video of people pretending like children don't know history, which is incorrect. Most people know about how YouTube came out in 2005 and how iPads weren't a thing till like the 2010s. We're not that stupid. Another thing that's wrong with this video is the fact that a majority of Gen Zers didn't even exist during the 90s. I mean, I understand that um, Gen Z started in 1997, but a majority of us lived in the 2000s and after. 
Oh, these dating apps are useless. Because you're a simp with Skibbity Riz. What? Skippity Ohio Riz. Are you scatting? Scatting. Like me, ba 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 da bo, ba 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 da bo. Cringe. Then what the Scooby Dooby Doo are you talking about? I'm saying your Riz is dog water. <laughs> My Riz is high quality H2O. That doesn't make sense. Says the bippity boppity boo boy. Oh, are we scatting? Apparently not. Bruh, I'm just saying, unless you got hella squilly or Delulu to think that a girl with a gat is gonna catch feelings for a chuggy Chad with Skibbity Riz. Ow! Oh, is this pig Latin? I'm saying you're a loser with no charisma. Oh! Finally some English. And honey, that's not news to anyone. Boom! Got a match. Who needs a skip it fraggle rock now? That's not even close to... I know for a fact that literally no one in Gen Z speaks like this unironically. Because this skibbity stuff is mostly Gen Alpha and it's a type of brain rot. And no one talks like this unless they're making fun of someone. This is just... I'm, I'm out of words um i did not script this video <sighs> she's such a stan you know eminem came up with that right uh no he didn't uh yeah he did the guy you're trying to cancel wrote a song called stan about a crazy suicidal fan see that's terrible so terrible that you turned it into a fun slang term um it's just impossible to cancel someone who came to piss the world off yeah, but he... Ugh, just let it go before M comes to Thanos snap your entire generation from existence with a quick 16 bars. He wouldn't dare. <laughs> okay, you funny. Oh. So, um, based off this video, from what I'm getting, Eminem made a song called Stan about a suicidal fan, but in Gen Z language, Stan means super fan, so it's completely different. But it probably did take inspiration from the song... Also, no one in Gen Z is trying to cancel Eminem. Literally, literally no one is trying to cancel him. I don't know who told you that, but um, no one is. That That is the tr truth. No one is trying to cancel Eminem right now, and um, you're fighting air. Well, that's the end of this video. Um, If you have... Any, if you see anything wrong with this video, then make a very similar video deconstructing everything I say here and turn me into a villain because I like when people do that. Um, anyways, I'm going to say the YouTuber thing now. Uh, like and subscribe and goodbye. And also, I hate my fans.